Hey, g'day guys. It's Calvin from the Cartridge Company in New Zealand. Today I'm going to have a, a chat about the speedo outputs on 1UZ VVTIs. It's a problem that I see quite a bit of, uh, not just on the 1UZ, but on the JZs as well, with the computers of the similar era, around that uh, about 97 onwards. Uh, and the speedo output from the automatic goes to the computer, and then it is transmitted to the dash via the multiplex, which is a, a CAN bus. If you do a Google on CAN, uh, Communication Area Network, you'll, you'll find out about that. Uh, it's like dark voodoo magic for electricity and signals. So I've, I've whipped together today, I've, I've grabbed a tail shaft housing from an auto. I've got the centre shaft in it. I've got the trigger wheel, or an equivalent trigger wheel, which looks like this. And uh, with a bit of super glue, and crossing my fingers, it's set up in my drill press. I just happened to have a VVTi sitting on the stand, just convenient really, that happened to still have the rear speed sensor wiring in it. I didn't even plan that, that, that was just how it worked out. I've got a Speedo here, that's out of an early 2000s Hilux. So with this in the drill press, it allows me to generate a speed signal without starting this noisy engine, because the old ears get a bit sore at times. But let's fire it up and have a look. And that's then generating a signal that's coming to my ECU, which allows me to make that work. So let's test it and have a look, see what happens. So there we have it. 1UZ VVTi wiring with a speedo output. If you want uh, solutions like this, uh, they are included in the wiring instructions and diagrams that the cartoon company sells. It emails at the end of the video. Hope that's helpful. Talk to you again.